To convert your video files into the DXV format, you'll go to resloom.com, go to download, and you can download Resloom's free Alley 2.0, which will give you this converter and the DXV3 codec. And I'm on a Mac, so this is the one I click on. And then after I download it, I'll launch Alley. And then you click open, where you can select a file or multiple files. And we'll open this file. So as you can see right here, you can view it. And this has a transparent background because normally if you're VJing a bunch of clips, you wanna have alpha channels so that you can layer stuff. So this original file is Apple ProRes 444 and I exported it with straight alpha, not pre-multiplied. So what you do is, after you've previewed your loop and it looks good, you'll come down to the bottom left and click convert file. And now you have conversion settings. So on presets, you can select uh, DXV, normal quality, no alpha, some others. I normally just go to DXV, normal quality with alpha. And there you go, transparent background. And what we'll do here is click Q1 file. And now it will convert the file and it normally converts really fast. So yeah, it's done. And if you have multiple files that you need to convert, it's pretty simple. All you do is go to your folder that has the files you need and select them all, open them, uh, you can preview each one to make sure they look good. So with these three files, I'll just click this top one, click shift, click the bottom file, and now all three are selected. The bottom left, you can see it says convert three files and you can set your presets, click Q3 files, and they will all automatically start converting. I hope this helped. Subscribe and like if you liked the video and I'll be making some more. If you liked the animations in this demo, you can join my email list to get some free VJ loops to test out. Just click on the link in the description or info card to get your free animated loops at mikebuzan.com slash email list.